By now, he's been out of the Enclave longer than he was in. Most people know when to hang it up and start over. But not Moreno. Okay, so he's old cantankerous, doesn't know when to let go. But on the plus side, Vertibird. Yippee, yeah, there'll be no wedding bells for... And we're back. This time in Westside, where we're looking for yet another member of the Remnants. Somebody called Judah Krieger? Oh, sorry about that. I had a late breakfast. Yes, I did. Um, I believe it's somebody we've already spoken to. The... Old gentleman outside the pawn shop with the red hat. Are you sticking around for the attractions? Absolutely. Actually, you know what? I've not really... We've not visited Westside much, have we? Um, Arcade asked me to find you. I'm gather gathering the remnants. Hello, Arcade. Making some new friends, are you? Why the need for a bunch of old war horses like us? Uh, you'll be the element of surprise. Yes, you'll be the element of surprise because nobody expects the remnants. Probably really true, actually. Um, it was Arcade's suggestion, not mine. You tell me. No, no, no. You'll be the element of surprise. Swooping in on a vertebrate, guns blazing. Oh, Haven't yeah. done that in years, but all right, I'm in. None of this means a thing if the rest of the group doesn't show up, though. Oh, and you'll need my part of the passphrase to get into the bunker. Navarro. Okay, oh, okay. I'd like to know more about your former squad. I was the officer in charge, and Johnson and Moreno were my heavy hitters. Henry handled tech things, and Whitman flew the chopper. Johnson and Moreno never got along, and I had my hands full keeping those two apart some days. It was a difference in philosophy, mostly. Mercy was not part of Moreno's vocabulary. Yeah, yeah, he seems a little, you know... Tightly wound up, doesn't he? Tell me about the old days with the Enclave, oh good grief. This is always a bad idea with somebody of the elderly persuasion, but go ahead. I miss those days sometimes. We all had a purpose, you know? I admit that some of the folks in charge were pretty ruthless. The rest of us, though, we were just trying to civilize things. The NCR was still new, and it didn't look like they'd last all that long. Then we lost the oil rig, and... Shortly after that, the base at Novaro. Nobody left except us remnants. Yeah, this is the whole thing with trying to civilize the world, isn't it? It often comes dangerously close to trying to take it over with an iron fist and tell absolutely everyone what to do on pain of death. Uh, what happened to the Enclave oil rig and Novaro? I think Internal I know. sabotage took down the oil rig. Never did get the full story. The NCR took out Navarro, saying we posed a threat to the region. Okay, then. Oh, well, then, that, that uh -huh. was it. Uh-huh. Thank you. Judah Krieger is the glue that's kept us all together over the years, and with good reason. Anyone who can command Moreno and Johnson in the same unit without somebody getting fragged is one hell of a leader. Krieger was polite and kind, but never warm. He always did his best to make me feel welcome in the group. I think he did it out of a sense of loyalty to my father. Loyalty means a lot to Judah. Not loyalty to the Enclave, or even the ideals they fought for, but to the people who served with him. They're loyal to you too? That's their story, Arcade, not yours. They're loyal to you? Well, of course they are. You're part of the group. Sometimes I wonder how much of my father they see in me. They went through a lot together, but my family went through it too. I'm glad they've watched out for me all these years. Maybe someday I can return the favor. Yeah. Okay, the dog's stuck on the bloody van again. Have you seen that tower on the strip all lit up? We need to get him, I don't know, like big wide shoulder pads with bumpers on them so they like deflect him off. Yeah, no, I can appreciate loyalty. This is one of the things I think I share with him. This, this sense of looking after the people that are with you. You know what? While we're here, let's take some stuff that we've got to sell and check out the local merchants. Okay, it is dark in here. Hello? What did Contreras say? Okay, draw a weapon. We agreed you should... 
Who are you? What? Why? Why? Why do I have this odd compulsion to tell you you're going to die and draw away? I don't. I don't. Okay. Who's Contre Contreras? Isn't that the guy in the military base? Okay, you and him were in some sort of. D um. Can I? Can I get back to you on? D Apparently not. Um. Contreras will still get his. Killing you will just save me some paperwork. Okay, but look, sit. I. Uh -oh. <laughs> Okay. Bad guys dealt with. Right. Um. Um. You are Miguel. You're you're the shop key. Keller. Leather armor trail carp. Oh, I can sell it. Leather armor might be able to make. Is this? Who is this? Hello? Here to do business? Well, maybe. I, I, but... Until next time. Are you not remotely bothered that I shot a man in the head in your pawn shop? He was sat at your desk and I shot him in... So I hear the honcho of one of them strip families up and disappeared. Poof. Yeah. They'll find his body someday. Okay, fine. Here would, to do business? Would you like to buy some stuff? Like Of course. The weapons and armor I just took off that man over there? Maybe I should go back to was it McCarran? McCarran Air Base and find that guy and I cannot even remember what we were doing. I remember he was up to some shady stuff. This is Castle Madrid Apartments. You are Marco. Nobody seems to have been bothered by the gunfire, including the man who was actually... Okay, the co-op. The man who was the owner. Really, have they not got any lights in these places? Hello, excuse me. Doc, please. You ever seen one of those rangers in black armor? I wouldn't want to make one of those mad. How would you know? They wear helmets. Uh, hi. Hi. Uh, tell me about the co-op. It might not look like much, but True. it's what keeps us Westside locals independent. We started it a few years ago. I admit we had a lot of trouble at first, but eventually we got some help from Tom Anderson with the followers. We're finally to the point where the co-op members can start making money Tom from sales instead Anderson. of just breaking even. Isn't that the guy that... Didn't I have dealings with him? Something about water and a missing NCR? I, okay, you know what? Never mind. All right. Less than 20,000 caps from the half million mark. Yes, indeed. Acme reality. That still freaks me out a little bit. Building a settlement. You need to work on the wall. Hello, mean son of a bitch. Oh, hi again. Hello. Okay. Mm hmm. Goodbye. Okay, I have no idea what just went down there. We have. This is for rent. Door to cat's apartment. Have I been in there? Have I been in there? Okay. It's a bit of a mess. It's more than a bit of a mess. If I didn't have my pit boy, I wouldn't be able to see a damned thing. We haven't seen anybody in a while. Maybe the monsters have stealth suits too. No, no, no we haven't seen anyone for a while, have we? I mean, by that, I mean in this building. I mean, door to stairwell. I mean, it's an apartment complex. Does nobody live here? And why is that door inaccessible? Surely they could rig something office. Do oh, the door's mechanisms have been broken, but you can get the door to open if you know 
I, I can repair that. You have, you have fixed the office door and can get in now. Oh, ow. Okay, why would I want to? You know what, this, this means no one's been in here for a while then. If I had to fix them, that would be stealing. That would be terrible. I'm not a terrible person. No, I'm, no, I'm not. And I kind of have a rule. Don't steal from people unless you know who the person is and you don't mind shooting them if they discover you. It's a good rule. Because I figure it like this. If it's someone you don't like, they've probably done something wrong to you and you've probably got a good reason to shoot them in the first place and therefore it's not really stealing. It's just taking payment for damages received by being irritated by the person, right? Oh, no, that, that, that's not what I wanted to, to go. Pip-Boy goes off when I go out. Okay, this is really freaking me out. What the hell is going on here? And why did I have to open an office door? I mean, it seems to me that if there's an office door that needs repairing to get into, there should be some overwhelmingly good reason for wanting to get in there. I don't know why I think that. When I say it out loud, it makes absolutely no sense. And yet I still believe it's completely and utterly true. Magazine vending machine. Ooh, Millsurp review. I mean, there's obviously people here. I can hear people while having fun. I can also hear a generator. We've got foot lockers. We've got wardrobes. We've got a place that would actually make a reasonable home if it weren't for the fact that the lighting kind of sucks. And we have a door to Cat's apartment's basement, which is also inaccessible. Well, this is going to drive me ever so slightly nuts. Yes, it is. However, there doesn't seem to be a lot I can do about that. As there doesn't seem to be an awful lot going on in there apart from... I did hear people having sex, right? I couldn't get upstairs. Do you think there's another way in? Well, I assume they were having sex. It sounded like sex. This door, I... Yeah, no, that one's... That's the side entrance. That is going to annoy me. There's an entire floor I can't get to and a basement I can't get to. I got into an office because... What are you guys staring at? All right, never mind. Liquor store. Klamath. Oh. No, no, no. That's Hello? Or something. Okay, I'm sorry. What happened to your voice? Hey, stranger. Hope you've been well. What do you need? Uh, did, have you been sucking on helium or something? Never mind. Show me what you got for right, sale. Then. Hopefully I've got something to what you whistle. Who's the new sheriff? That should keep the powder gangers away. Ru have I been down here? Engineer. Okay, you're the guy that's responsible for setting up lights and stuff, yeah? Could you do a better job, especially inside buildings? Because it's pretty much impossible to get around here. I think, Who do that, you think there's my van. All right. Dr. Klein or Dr. Boros? Okay. I the NCR Wolf's the Bakery. Down. I don't think I've... He's got lights. Hello, Mr. Wolf, vending machine, uh, with free Nuka-Cola. Fine, I, I'll take that, I guess. Hello? Hello? I'm here to do business, the bakery man's apartment. Okay, seriously, dude, you've got your shop. Totally and utterly open. Anyone can walk in. And you've got nobody guarding it. Oh. 
That's not the radio that's on. There must be... There must be another radio upstairs. Out my way, out my way, out my way. Okay, we will we'll call in his apartment and point out that he's not... You examine the door, the lock has been broken by someone trying to pick it. But it could be fixed if you have to know how that is. Repair 95. Repa Why do I keep discovering broken doors? I'm going to repair the knob. You fix the apartment, apartment door and can get in. That's not a good sign, is it? Is that Wolf? How long has he been dead then? Well, there's the radio. The Baker's Man! Just have a quick look around before we... Thomas Wolf, who has been dead or... Oh, he might not have been dead a long time. He might have burnt to death. It's difficult to know. It would have been a very, very tightly controlled burn then because nothing else is burnt except for him but it, apart from a little bit of carpet scorching energy weapon could have been an energy weapon couldn't it okay i guess okay well apparently this stuff is all mine now right let's find out what the hell happened here uh operation i'm guessing he's not talking about a medical operation. The baker's man can. Welcome back, Master Baker Thomas. Again, it happens. Damn it, every time my nephews come over, they break one of my collection pieces. This time it's my brand new flying saucer. That thing was a hundred bucks. Well, now it's on the top shelf. I should put it there in the first place. Gonna have to see if I can get Jimmy over in the store to fix it. Okay. More profit than it. Okay, hello. This is great. Ever since I started using that new recipe, the dough is rolling in faster than I can count it. I have to keep the recipe's ingredients under wraps or it'll end up in the state or... I'll end up in the state pen or maybe worse, I really should put it back in the safe. I have a feeling Wolf did not get burnt to death with laser weapons and in fact died many, many years ago. If he's worrying about the state pen. And the black marks are just dirt. It's not a scorch mark. Okay. Collect collection items for completion. List of items for my different collections. Robots, rockets. Of okay, that's not totally helpful. All right, so I have a feeling this gentleman died a long, long time ago. But he was making something. The, the big question is, what was he making? What was the recipe for? It's in his safe, which is under his bed. Was there... I tell you what, we could probably just do a better looting in a second. I'm just... I'm trying to look for clues. Just as a warning, We're all lit up. Is it Christmas? I'm not trying to be sneaky. I'm... Where's Arcade? I'm trying to actually. Nobody ever notices shut up. me. I'm trying to. But they notice the pit boy light. Open the floor safe with a. There's nothing there. There's absolutely nothing there. It wasn't even. L you know what? Let's take it off. Okay. Recipe for what? The thing is, this area was not trapped behind or inaccessible behind a broken door. So even if this guy has been here since before the war, that doesn't explain the shop. I mean, everything here, box of detergent, you know what? I'm probably, I'm gonna loot everything, obviously, because it doesn't look like anyone's actually here, but. There are actually lights on and a store. Why has nobody taken over this store? Okay, this is definitely, definitely freaking me out. And why is the fridge placed like that? I mean, was he trying to make it feel more... 
You know what? Never mind. It's going to drive me nuts yet again. I, I have a feeling something is going on in West Side. But it's probably something that is none of my business. And what I should do is get on with something that is my business. And that is finding the last remnant. Although, obviously, the first thing to do is find my van. Okay, that's another door to the Mojave Wasteland. But there's something over there. Yes, I, I found something else other than the van. And I want to go and check it out. Thor! What exactly? Okay. Have I? Prim wimped out I've really not done some people do. an awful lot of exploration of this neighborhood, have I? No, I've not. What have we got? Are those raiders? Those look like raiders. Are those raiders, guys? Have we got raiders over there? We got some apartments. All of them boarded up. Why are all these apartments boarded up? You should use them for something. Are there any shops the around here? The NCR, taking care of okay, I, the NCR are terribly inefficient, that's why. Oh. Okay, there are rather a lot of them. Sneaking done. Fighting now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's, 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 they are raiders. Okay, fine. That, that explain. Oh, it's a big. That is a big gun. David. David without a head. Oh, nice shooting arc. Whoa. Yay. Yeah. Keep you on your feet. Oh, thank you. She's giving me stim packs. Actually, nice timing. Yes, I know. That's Just all. Are you okay, dude? Could you just... Uh, be passive. Be very, very passive. Some Retrieve Marlowe's finger. Oh, God. Didn't I have a bounty? I think I've had bounties. I can't remember where I picked up these bounties. Friend. Sorry, not friend. Fiend. Fit close. Close. This is other friend. Simon, David, and Marlowe. Those names probably are supposed to mean something. I know I took a lot of... I did take a lot of bounties. Up near Good Springs, wasn't it? Wasn't there a kind of... The, I can't remember. It has been such a long time. You know what? That bullet in the head affected me more than I thought. And you've got a lot of stuff. A little bit closer to my magic million. Quest, Marlow Barksdale's finger. Completed. Collect your reward. Collect it from where and from who? The target. Okay, let's show the location. The location is Boulder City. Okay. Boulder City Jail. That's where we were picking up a ton of contracts. Oh, God. This is from my life as a bounty hunter, which is over. Sort of. Kind of. I mean, I'll still take the odd bounty, I guess, but... Well, there's a reward, so we're going to collect it at some point. However, right now, I want to check out Thor. It's Thorn. That's an N. It's an N. Thor. For some reason, my eyes were drawn to the arrow. I was like, Thor. Okay? Skip the N. See? That is a bad logo. You see? It doesn't work visually because your Anything eyes... New happening? Shut up. Manhole to the Thorn. I've been down here, I think. I've got vague memories of it. But we've... We've established recently that... My vague memories are often ghosts of a past that wasn't mine. Maybe stuff I did before I was shot in the head. 
New Vegas citizen. Guard. Hi, guys. What is... Okay. I hear the Greek cons just packed up and left Red Rock Canyon. Yes, they did. They got bored. I wanted to find their route. Red Lucy! I'd remember if I had seen you here before. That's I'm good, because... Sure my memory. What do you want? What is this place? Basically, yeah, that's that's what I want to the know. The clamor of our bloodthirsty crowds reaches every corner of the wasteland. But I'll pretend that your ignorance doesn't offend me, stranger. This is the Thorn. Okay. Here's where the strong make a name for themselves. And the weak are fed to the jaws of hell. You can bet on the contenders. Or, if you have what it takes, be one of the contenders. Be warned. The Thorn demands respect. Break the rules, or offend me in any way, and I'll gut you open for all to see. Yeah, you might find that harder than you think. Tell me more about the place. What do you want to know? What are the rules? How do you trade? So they fight with creatures. Let me know. Not interested. I'm listening. Uh, I've got questions about Westside. Ask, and you might get an answer. Okay, very mysterious sounding. Is Westside part of New Vegas? New Vegas has many faces, stranger. Oh my Despite God. everything, it shall never be whole. When the land hunts you, when fighting for survival is the norm, your neighbors become either saviors or enemies. Westside is a part of New Vegas, just as much as it's a part of the wasteland. In the end, stranger, we need them both to continue making our fate. Okay, you have a very soothing voice that for some reason is not soothing me because you're talking like a creepy person in a creepy place. Just saying. How do people manage to survive? Westside attracts all sorts of travelers, including merchants and farmers. They come here to exchange their goods or to seek protection. Our community provides enough food, clothes, weapons, and medicine to encourage trade and to arm our defenses. The Thorn demonstrates, beyond anything else, that we're self-sufficient. Our desert blood has overcome even the strongest beasts of the Wasteland. Tell me again about the Westside's relationship to New Vegas, or say goodbye. So long, stranger. Right, well that was... vaguely interesting and a little... odd. Right, let's see if I can remember how the hell to get out of here. Find the van and go and talk to Doc Henry, who is the last of the remnants. Is Jacobstown really that far up the mountains that there's snow? I mean, I know theoretically during the night, deserts get pretty cold, but... I mean, we would have to be pretty high up, wouldn't we? To get this kind of weather? Either that, or we'd have to travel a lot further north than I'd expected. Where's... Where's... Oh, of course I left Lily back at the house. Yes, I did. Oh my god, you guys have not cleaned the mess up yet? I hear the NCR and the Kings have been getting along. That's good news for Freeside. It is really, isn't it? I mean, actually, if you think about it, I have been doing an awful lot of peacekeeping. I'm a bit of a hero. I really am. I've got them to play nice with the kings, with the Brotherhood. You know, it's... Is there something else I can do for you? Okay. I'd like you to perform cybernetic surgery. No, I will... Actually, you know what? I probably should check my cybernetic implants. Arcade Ganon has asked me to gather all the former members of the Enclave in the Mojave. I'm intrigued, so I'll go to this reunion. I'll be handing things over to Calamity, so talk to her if anything comes up. Oh, you'll need my word from the past phrase to get into the bunker. Friends. Don't forget it. Okay. How does the research for the night... Can cure go? Promising, but I won't be able to synthesize the drug anytime soon. I really should get back to my work. Well, no, you you, you should get to flying around in, in a vertebrate. Yes, yes. 
Short-term memory problems. Doc Henry always was a hard one to figure out. It didn't seem to matter whether he was working with humans or dogs. He had an equal lack of affection for both. A regular Diogenes. I'm not sure what the man was after. Knowledge is power, but to what end for Henry, I have no idea. The problem was what mattered to him, not its practical impact. He simply solved riddles because they existed. See, this is the thing. You think knowledge is power, but sometimes knowledge is just knowledge. And that's what somebody wants. If you like knowledge, if you enjoy knowledge, getting knowledge is good. It's like caps. Sometimes people want caps so they can buy stuff and get stuff. But sometimes people just want caps because they like having caps. I mean, I'm a bit of both. I like to be able to spend caps, but I like having them. There's something about having lots and lots of money that feels good, you know? And for him, it's knowledge. The difference is he can't really spend knowledge. He can use it, I suppose. His work was what mattered to him. It seems pointless to do all that without a gun. No, it doesn't. Man's happy. Leave the man alone. Not everyone dreams of being a revolutionary, I suppose. Maybe we can't all change the world. Maybe it's enough just to do good for the short time that we're here. No one's going to sing Doc Henry's praises when he's gone. But he's probably saved more lives than I ever will. Yeah, that, that, that's true, but that goes for a lot of people. Hey, that goes for a lot of people, if you think about it. There's an awful lot of people out there, unsung heroes, I suppose you'd call them, doing work that helps so many people and no one gives a damn. And then some idiot gets up on stage, jiggles their bottom around a little bit, and everyone goes nuts and treats them like royalty. It's kind of depressing when you think about it. However, right, wait, what are we doing now? Uh, data. Quests. Did we forget someone? Old lung. Oh, no, right. Gain access to the remnants bunker, and that is... Not too far from here. Well, that was lucky, wasn't it? Convenient, even. It's just around this rocky outcrop. Somewhere. Here, maybe? Or did I misjudge the... this... Okay, where the, where the hell are we? No, it, it... I it's... assure you, you look extremely virile. Now, would you mind pointing that somewhere else? Thanks. Okay, fair enough. No, you're absolutely right. I was about to get a bit snippy with you, but you're, you're totally right. You shouldn't point guns at people unless you're actually trying to shoot said people. Bad practice. Very bad practice. Indeed. It's right below me, isn't it? We've got a cave-like feeling. Hit. Remnants! Bunker! It's... Oh, God. It's a hatch! Fair enough. Can we keep this? Can we have a bunker? I've kind of always wanted a bunker. I don't think I want to live here, but having a bunker? Oh god, actually, I'm beginning to sound like a madman, aren't I? I'm, I'm going to want a robot army of doom soon. Okay, dear old friends, remember Navarro. And that, all I needed was the phrase, I didn't, it didn't need to be said by the people, voice recognition or something. This seems a little... Okay. Ask the remnants to support the fight against the Legion or the NCR. Why can't we ask them to just fight alongside me for, like, you know, neither side? Maybe we just, you know, maybe maybe I do want to take over myself. I am seriously thinking Arcade would actually make a pretty good uh, governor. Yes, he would. Okay. Oh! <gasps> Bertie bird. Power armor. Hmm? Bertie bird. Look over there. And 
Holy. It's not my thing, but... Oh my... God. Where have you guys gone? Please don't tell me the dog is stuck on the vertebrate now. Okay, never mind. Doesn't matter. Okay, this would all... Okay, I'm, I'm having a moment. That's a little better. I've also noticed I'm somewhat dehydrated. Yes, I am. I should probably hotkey the uh, the water. I really, I want a water bottle that I just occasionally sip when thirsty. Okay, right. So, what do we got to do? We got to... Go in here. Door to remnants. But whoa. Okay, they're all waiting for us. That was. How did they get here ahead of us? I bet no one has ever been as unnoticed as me. Well, you would be unnoticed if you didn't keep chirping up and talking and making everyone uncomfortable. Or, or, or Ryan Marino. Hello. Do, what do we do? Do we just do I hide? What are you talking to me for? Talk to Krieger. Talk to, to Krieger. Okay. Talk Howdy. to Krieger. Hello. Glad to see you made it here all right. So, who are we going up against? Um... Okay, I want to help the MCR, I help the Legion. How are you going to deploy your squad? Uh... Marino, Johnson, Henry and I will be the boots on the ground. Whitman will stay with the Vertibird. Uh... I... Okay. What is this place? This was a minor refueling station for Vertibirds. It seemed an appropriate place to stash our equipment if we ever needed it. I'm surprised this place hasn't fallen apart. When I put it into standby mode, I expected to return to it within a few years, not decades. Okay. Well, we're not helping the Legion, but I'm, I don't I don't think I want you to help the NCR either. I kind of want you to fly around the vertebrate and help me out, do whatever I want to do. Which might involve eventually, you know, taking over Vegas myself, maybe. I do fancy running the casino. Um... Okay. You still need time to think? Not really. I just don't have anything to tell that you to do. On the strip, the one you can see for miles. I hear it ain't sealed up no more. Dude, what's up? They, they seem to want to know who to attack, and I kind of don't necessarily want to attack anyone or defend anyone. Well, you know, I mean, I'm not saying I don't want to defend Sierra. the NCR. Maybe I haven't made my decision. Can you guys just sort of hang around here a little bit and, and, you know, do your thing? Maybe? It looks nice here. Is there a bathroom or something? That was a little awkward, wasn't it? I, um, the thing is, obviously we're not siding with the Legion. Could you stop doing that? But... I know we've talked about the NCR as a... Could you please stop doing that? We talked about the NCR as the lesser of the four evils, but the thing is, he's... The independent New Vegas is beginning to sound nicer and nicer. Partly because the NCR are beginning to irritate me more and more. I mean, the fact that they don't even want to pay me for doing work for them is kind of annoying. But... Okay. Hate those things. We we've got to get in. That that's where the van is, I think. Unless I've gone the wrong way, which is sneaking done. Fighting now. Yeah. Right. What? Oh God. One down. That one seems to be crippled. Oh god. Oh don't die to the don't die to the that all? Seriously, you don't want to mess with those things. No, you don't. The stings are kind of valuable and can be used for some good stuff, as can the or is it just the poison glands? I can't remember actually. Don't we have barbs as well? Did we do all of them? There's the one that got closer. So what was I saying? Um yeah, so, 
Maybe what we do is we talk to Yes Man and see what our options are. This one looks pretty tough. This one where? Who? Whoa! Oh, God, I thought there were casadors. I saw lots of legs and thought that was lots of casadors. Fighting over. Yeah, you know. Where are we? There's the road. Let's not. Let's just get to the road and avoid all the creepy crawlies. And bugs. Giant mantis foreleg. I think I've been here. All right. Okay, yeah, so let's get back, talk to Yes Man, and see what our options are. Because the independent Vegas with, you know, maybe you running the day-to-day -day stuff and being the visible face of whatever we decide to call it. And me making all the, you know, executive decisions, the big decisions, whilst running the casino and making us tons of cash. Because that would be awesome. I mean, there is some appeal to it. I'm still a bit worried about the whole yes man thing, though. You're, well, you're a doctor, not a scientist. I'm pretty handy with the whole electronics thing. Do you think we can rig the computer system in houses, uh complex to have a kill switch that we don't mention something that's you know almost low tech a big lever just pull it and it shuts the entire thing down if 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 you know if we plug yes man in and he goes all the power you know cuz that's what i'm deeply afraid of Yes, indeed. Okay. Oh, hi again. Can I help you with something else? Right, I want to talk about... I'm ready to, for you to join me at the Lucky 38. Let's talk about the tribes. I should get to know we can do that later. Mr. House is out of the picture already. You already took care of Mr. House? Wow, you work fast. Okay, let's talk about the... Tri no, um... Okay, look. Join me in the Lucky 38, okay? We, we'll... I want to know what the plan is. I want to know what the plan is, because we may have some more help. Uh, along with the tribes we need to discuss. But, uh, This is probably a mistake, but fine. Join me at the Lucky 38. Mr. House is out of the picture, and you have the platinum chip. Wonderful. Let's go. Okay. Meet Yes Men at the Lucky. You're just going to make your own way there, right? We're not going to wander out together. Probably for the best. Guess I don't want to be seen leaving this place with you. People might think we're friends. It does occur to me that if I decide to take over Vegas... I mean, they probably won't mind if I take over Vegas, right? I mean, house was in control of Vegas. If I take control of Vegas, that will be fine. But if we try to take control of the dam, and I'm not saying we should, because I think maybe that's going a little too far. If we do that, the NCR are probably not going to be happy. And they're going to be, well, I'm going to be looking over my shoulder for th them. Okay. Hi, this is big, huh? A very big moment. Here it goes. I'll just take that platinum chip off your hands. Thanks. Wish me luck. Um. Yeah, I'm trying to wish you luck. Okay, if you explode, I'm not going to be happy because I can't move backwards. I'm trying to move backwards and it won't let wow. me. Wow. Mr. House had quite a setup here. I can access his data banks and view telemetry on every Securitron on the network. Wait, so that's what the platinum chip does. Okay. Interesting. Now Mr. House had a whole demonstration planned for you. Just head downstairs to the lowest level to check it out. 
You'll see. Okay. Step closer to the demonstration area, please. Completed. Okay, so you're familiar with Securitrons by now, obviously. I mean, some of your best friends are Securitrons, right? <laughs> Uh, our titanium alloy housing does a good job of protecting our delicate electronic inside and small arms fire and shrapnel. Our left arm contains oh. an X-25 gapping laser, quite deadly against off targets of medium range. That looks like fire. And for close range suppression and ground control, we have this handy dandy 9 mm submachine gun knife. All of this will pass, right? It gets interesting. Turns out that those are our secondary weapons. All this time we've been running the Mark I operating system, which doesn't have drivers for our primary weapons. Imagine! Yeah, imagine. Now watch this. I'm downloading the Mark II OS to all Securitrons on the network. Makes quite a difference. Are their faces red? Whoa! A rapid fire launching system makes us deadly in close range engagements. Woo! Look at that! You're freaking me out. Drivers for our onboard auto repair systems. Just try to hurt us now. That's ominous. This software upgrade confers a 235% increase in combat effectiveness. Per unit. Okay. New Vegas finally has soldiers worthy of protecting it. I hope you enjoyed this demonstration. You can come back up and see me or be on your way. I know you're a busy person. Okay, this is where I ask, what the hell have I done? Yippee! -yay. I got spurs that jingle, jangle, jingle, jingle, jangle, as I go riding merrily.